it was given favorable treatment after uh, it stayed on for a while. Actually, it was uh, New York decided they were going to cancel it at the end of the first 13 episodes because we were over budget. And our budget for Bonanza in color was $105,000 an episode the first year. Now, if you think of $105,000 for an hour film and you think in terms of what NBC is paying today for ER, which is $13 million an episode, that means that one episode of ER costs as much as three or four years of, of Bonanza. But we were $250,000 over budget at the end of first, the first 13. And I had to guarantee New York that we would be on budget by the end of the year uh, if we wanted if they, to get them to let us continue. We did 39 episodes in those days. And uh, David Dorto, who was the producer, was really very good at uh, watching budgets. And we had a very good production department uh, in uh, our West Coast operation. And we did come in within budget. And when Bonanza was moved. It's time period. Time period was moved to the 9 o'clock Sunday time period and sponsored by Chevrolet. It immediately shot up and became number one uh, in rating of all the shows on all the networks for four or five years. It was always in the top ten. but And uh, then it was treated as, a, uh, as an important NBC asset, which indeed it was, because it, it had the most exposure of any show worldwide. It was in 83 countries, and it, and it really was, it, where, whereas Matinee Theater was the start, the spark plug for color television, uh, Bonanza really propelled color television forward because it was the first uh, primetime, nighttime film show in color. And uh, it sold a lot of television sets. And that was one of the reasons that NBC, that RCA pushed to do Bonanza in color. It's a, a program very dear to your heart. Yes, I think it, it was because it was our first house production, really. We had a subsidiary company called California National Productions uh, which was set up by NBC as a subsidiary company to do syndicated film shows, which were house productions. But they were all for syndication, not for, uh, they were all black and white for in the beginning, uh, not for the network. So Bonanza was the first in-house show that we produced specifically for the NBC network. 